Hey, if you can't make it to the Caribbean, there's no excuse to not look hot in style. When it's cold outside, don't worry. We've got the best fashion ideas to keep you warm. And George Brescia knows how to make you look smashing. That's why he's here today with some great ideas. Looking great in the wintertime. How do yes. you do it? Ernie, I call this how to look hot when it's cold. Yeah. Right? It's freezing outside. So sometimes people just go into the closet in a panic and yeah. they just start grabbing things and throwing it on. Right. And then they walk warm. outside and people are like, whoa, what are you wearing? All right, we got to calm it down. Okay, what do we do? Get a thought process going here. Yeah. First of all, I think it's really great because right now in the marketplace, we have these jackets both for men and women mm -hmm. that are super fitted, right. right? They show the body. Yeah. So it could be in down, it could be in wool, you know, but it really gives that silhouette. Because the and material is different. That's now. right. It's not so bulky. That's exactly right. right. Lighter weight, but the technology is there to keep you very warm. Mm -hmm. So that's the first thing. Get a jacket that's super fitted to your body. Okay. Okay. Then, it, for the guys, it's about a skinny jean, right? So we see that silhouette of the leg. It's a skinny look, right? right. For the girls, you could do like a leather legging. Oh, yeah, right? sure. That so that keeps it kind of sexy mm -hmm. underneath the jacket. And maybe she's doing a little booty or a higher over the knee boot, yep. right? So that's really cool. So it's the silhouette is basically what we're talking you about here. Like, you like to pull things together, right? I you, do. You like things to, to match the, the gloves, the yes, hats, and yes, so forth. Yes. You like that. Yeah, I do because it, you look like you're confident. You look like you're pulled together. So what that means to me is you're wearing maybe all black, right? Yeah. But then you're going to do like a cream hat with a cream glove and nice. a big cream scarf. Nice. Right? So that looks really good. Mm -hmm. Or if you're doing like you know, it's all navy or something like that. Maybe you're going to pop a color. So you could do a red hat and a scarf and a glove. As long as all the accessories match, it pulls you together. And the good thing, too, George, is that there are a lot of colors to choose from today. Yes, okay? absolutely. Because, I mean, traditionally, in the wintertime, you'd wear the dark colors. That's right. But now you can really make it pop. Yeah, you can. So that's the other thing. So not only if you want to pop it with the accessories, right. but maybe you're going to do all dark accessories and a dark uh, something on the bottom, whether right. it's a legging or a jean, and then you do the colorful jacket. Mm -hmm. So maybe that's where the fuchsia jacket comes in or the bright yeah. yellow jacket comes yeah, in. Like and it. that sort of comes from like the ski slopes, you and know what I mean? They can spot you right where you are. That's hey, right. one thing we want to talk about, okay, because a lot of people forget about this. Shoes, right? You yeah. have to have the right look with those shoes. Absolutely. Your, the, 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 the total look. That's right. So for me, what that means is, you know, for a girl, it's all about a sleek, kind of cool boot, right? You could have a lug sole on it, but maybe it's an over-the-knee boot, right? Mm -hmm. So that's kind of gives you that drama with that legging. Right. But on the bottom, it's a lug sole, so you could still wear it in the snow. And for the guys, it's just a clean, I would keep it dark, you know, like dark. a black boot. Right. You know, and it comes in all different kinds of materials and leathers and just, but keep it sleek, keep it cool. Keep it cool. I'm not big on hats, personally, yeah. okay? If you had to make a recommendation, free advice here, what kind of hat should I be wearing? Uh, you know what, huh? Ernie? I think you could do just the classic fedora. Fedora? Because, yeah, because the deal is this. That most of the heat comes out of your head in, when true. it's freezing, That's so true. as long as you're putting something on your on your head. So if you did a nice fedora, you're keeping that gentleman look I that like you do that. so well. I like that. You know, very Saville Row, and you're hitting the town. Hats off to you, George Russia. Thanks, sir. Thanks so much. Stay warm. Okay.